Hi, my name is Story DeWeese, and I'm a technical marketing engineer here at Cisco Systems. I'm excited to talk to you today about an upcoming webinar that we have covering topics of iOS XE programmability and automation. So in this webinar, we'll be covering some practical use cases and examples of how to use programmability in your own network. This will be on April 13th at 10 a.m. Pacific time. So now let's get into some details of what we'll actually cover during this webinar. First, we'll give an introduction to the recent white paper that has been released on Catalyst iOS XE programmability and automation. Then we'll go over programmability and automation overview, as well as demonstrating some real-time examples from day zero of device onboarding all the way through day end of device optimization. Next, we'll share some additional resources about how to get started on your programmability and automation journey. So here is the Cisco iOS XE programmability and automation overview. And we'll be talking today just about day zero <clears throat> in this top hand corner here. So this is when we have a device and we're first onboarding it. So we're plugging it in. We want it to actually gain access to our network and get its initial configs automatically. So this process is called zero touch provisioning or ZTP. And we can see similarly on the controller side, we have plug and play, but when we're working with controller less, we have ZTP. So how this works is we download a Python file and we can actually run that Python file directly on our catalyst switch. So in this case, we're using guest shell and send OS eight to actually run our Python file that we'll take a look at next. Here's an example, a simple Python file that we can use for zero touch provisioning. And here you can see we're just importing one module or one library. And from there, we're actually able to go in and configure our device directly. So in the following lines here, we see, okay, we're going to go in and configure a VLAN, assign an IP address, and all the other initial or day zero config. So with that, I would like to say thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you on April 13th to continue our conversation on programmability and automation and gain more experience and expertise there. Thank you.